Majestic has been saying this morning, today is a severe day with that snow in our area. Joining us this morning is Dave Parker with RDOT to tell us the plan for state roads. So Dave, what should people that are heading out the door this morning know? It will be a messy Monday morning, uh, specifically our, uh, there in the Benton County area. As you see, we've got a half dozen uh, minor, relatively minor accidents uh, popping up. Uh, we, we have a slushy uh, uh, surface right now. You know, it's not an ice uh, situation by any means, but it's going to be coming down for the next couple of hours. So it's really one of those uh, where we, RDOT, has to stay one step ahead. We could not do um, any pre-treating yesterday because the temperatures were still in the low 40s and of course the rain coming in would wash away a lot of that salt brine what's in our favor is the ground temperature has been so warm that what is coming down as snow uh quickly turns to kind of a slushy mix so we can easily plow it away but uh, since it's going to be coming down the next few hours it's a matter of us hitting that primary road and then coming back over and over and over again but we'll continue this uh through the 9 10 11 o'clock hour till everything looks better I think the roads are going to be okay today, uh, but as you saw, uh, accidents can happen, especially as you're uh, getting on and off the interstate. So uh, take it easy and slow. And Dave, we've talked about RDOT's salt supply. Are there any worries about it running out after this storm? No, no, actually that, that yesterday we had to be smart with it. We did not use any of the salt brine yesterday because we knew uh, putting it down was, was not going to help us any and pretty much a waste because Again, the temperatures were 40, 41 degrees. It doesn't really uh, help in that situation. And the rain was coming in, but wash it away. So smart with our resources yesterday. Heavy, heavy plowing today. All right, Dave Parker with RDOT. Dave, thank you so much as always.